Right now, we have the U.S. Navy vessel USS Minneapolis St. Paul departing through the Duluth Ship Canal. The U.S. Navy Freedom Class Littoral Combat Ship USS Minneapolis St. Paul was built in 2019 by Lockheed Martin and Fink Cantieri Marionette Marine at Marionette, Wisconsin. She measures 389 feet in length, 58 feet in width, and 13 feet in depth. She is powered by two Rolls-Royce MT-30 gas turbines, two Colts field, field stick diesel engines, and four Rolls-Royce water jets. All these systems give her a top speed of 45 knots or 52 miles per hour. Unique among combat ships, LCS vessels are designed to complete close to shore missions and is a growing and relevant part of the Navy's fleet. She is equipped with rolling airframe missiles and a Mark 110 gun capable of firing 220 rounds per minute. The USS Minneapolis St. Paul can carry two H-60 helicopters on board or one MH-60 helicopter in a UAV or unmanned aerial vehicle. She has a core crew of 50 personnel but she has accommodations for up to 98 sailors. The USS Minneapolis St. Paul was launched and christened in Marionette, Wisconsin as LCS-21 on June 15, 2019. The vessel will be commissioned or was commissioned uh, the, just this last weekend here in Duluth marking the ship's entry into Navy service. This is a very special occurrence for a commissioning to take place near a U.S. Navy vessel's namesake. Ships are named by the Secretary of the Navy and the last U.S. Navy vessel with this name was a submarine built in 1984 and decommissioned in 2008. Once she is commissioned, she will be based out of Mayport, Florida.